So today's Friday, September 23rd. I am on day 12 of Ultimate Reset and Three Week Yoga Retreat. That means I'm over halfway through. I said in the beginning that I was going to do a daily video diary telling you how I felt, and I haven't done that the last couple days, and that's really because I hadn't seen any new changes to report. So it was going to be a short video, so I decided to wait till the end of week two to kind of give you an update. And what I want to say is this round, round number four for me, has flown by. I had rationalized that it went by fast because I was number one already familiar with this program and the foods that I'm eating now aren't anything different because literally from the first time I did Ultimate Reset in 2012 it changed my eating habits tremendously and I have been eating the same food since then and that's really when I got into clean eating and I compared notes today and yesterday with people who had joined me on this journey and are also fellow coaches of mine and one said that this is flown, this is time period is flown by for her as well. And this is her first round. So I thought, okay, cool. It's not just me. When I started in 2012, the program was brand new. Um, there was not the shopping list. It wasn't laid out as the most user-friendly program. So I think too, I was in a mindset where I was just a few months into the program um, of eating healthy, of working out. So all the foods on here were things I'd never heard of and things that I'd never tried. So it was a little more overwhelming. Whereas other people have already that are joining me have already started eating healthy and been on this journey a little bit longer than I was when I started. And the fact is that we have a huge support network. There's a bunch of us doing it. We're talking every day. We're sharing our progress. We're sharing our meals. We're sharing our excitement. And so that is a big deal is having a partner, having somebody to talk to, or even ha just having a coach there who's been through it and done it before and can walk you through it. Today, I did a call with one of my personally sponsored coaches who said that she's been watching what I've been doing with the three-week yoga retreat and the ultimate reset and wanted to know what it was like and how I was doing. So with the three week yoga retreat, um, I'm loving it because it's very simple, very easy to follow. Literally, when they say you can close your eyes and do it, they are correct. They walk you through and cue you through every step. The best part is, is that I've done Pilates and I've done yoga, I've done Pio in the past, and a lot of those programs move fast because they're already for people that you know are have a base of fitness going or are ready to just learn as they go. This three week yoga retreat is literally for beginners. So they are moving you very slowly through each move. They're talking you through it. They're showing you each modified version. It's as if you have somebody who's taking their time and sitting right beside you saying, let's go at your pace and let me show you till you get it correct. It's not really like a, a class setting where you're having to keep up or trying to try and keep up with the uh, rest of the class. So that's what I love. And I realized that some of the poses that I've been doing in the past when I've done yoga were not the form was okay but I wasn't getting the maximum effect out of it because my form wasn't the perfect form that I should be holding while doing that pose. I really love yoga because it's been able to help keep me on track. I think I mentioned before that when I've done uh, Ultimate Reset in the past I didn't work out. Because all the workouts we had back then were pretty intense, and I just didn't have the time um, when I was working full time and um, you know trying to prepare the recipes. Now that I'm home and I'm doing this for the first time that I'm a full time coach, um, I have more time. And now that we have three week yoga retreat, it's perfect because it's, they said to not do anything strenuous while you're doing ultimate reset, but something like restorative yoga or walking or or something that is not going to take a toll on your body because your body's already going through major internal changes and getting a workout inside. You don't want to overdo it, and that's the big thing is a lot of people overtrain in general. So this is working out great because for me, it's so easy for me to fall off track. And I think everybody else out there could probably relate that one little deviation of your routine can throw it all off. So for me, all the times that I have done round one, two, and three of Ultimate Reset, I didn't work out. And it was so hard to get back on track whenever it was over. So now I'm still working out every day. I'm not doing anything overly strenuous, but I'm learning and I am becoming more flexible flexible and um, better balance and it's forcing me to relax for at least 20 to 30 minutes a day. I am a person who's wound up like an eight day clock like my grandpa said so if I'm forced to relax then I know that I will do it and it's something that I need and everybody needs especially in a very busy world. 
And the other thing that the coach was asking me about Ultimate Reset is she's done three-day refresh before and she thought that was kind of the same thing. And I explained to her, no, it's not. That Ultimate Reset comes with all of these all-natural supplements. There's nothing artificial. There's nothing in there that's going to make you run to the bathroom or, uh, you know, be stuck at the home while on it. This is a gentle cleanse that is really just gently pulling the toxins out of your body, helping you restore your body and resetting your body and learning to eat healthy, learning to eat regularly, and also learning how to eat clean and you're phasing out the processed foods and phasing out the sugar. So many people um, experience headaches in the beginning of ultimate reset and it just really depends on what your eating habit was like and every round for me has been different but really people are going through sugar withdrawals when, more than caffeine and they don't realize that so you know every round is different you're going to experience different um uh, things as your body uh you know, goes through the process of 21 days. Like usually my face is super clear when I am doing ultimate reset and um, other times it breaks out because I'm getting rid of the toxins. I'm very broken out. Um, I'm not sure if it's because of a new lotion that I started using or if it's that, you know, I had gotten way off track over the summer with my eating and now um, I have a lot of junk to clean out of my system. Plus, I haven't done this for three years. I'm not really sure. But again, every round is different. Every body is different. Every, every person's experience is different. But I highly recommend that everybody out there try Ultimate Reset at least one time in their life because I will tell you that when I started Ultimate Reset in July of 2012, I had just started my journey in um, February. Of 2012, and I was at that point just eating chicken and lettuce and drinking Shakeology and eating bananas and whole wheat uh, English muffins and almond butter, and um, that was pretty much my staples of healthy food. Ultimate Reset literally opened my eyes to what healthy food was and how to eat on a system and how to eat regularly and how to have an open mind and try different foods. And I watched my best friend try this the program too. And she literally became a totally different person mentally and emotionally over the course of 21 days. So what it can do for you inside and out, um, eating habit wise, physically and health wise, you know, along with the fact that my husband's cholesterol dropped 80 points is just worth it. I highly recommend that you set this on your goal list to do at least one time in your life. If you're somebody who doesn't ever know what to eat or when to eat, this is perfect because it gets you on a schedule. It tells you exactly what to eat, when to eat it, and how much to eat of it every day for 21 days. And that is what people need all the time. And once you get in a groove, these things just come naturally. I talked to somebody yesterday who said they don't have a lot of time to meal prep and they're so busy. But I believe people feel that way because it's unnatural and they think that if they have to stop what they're normally doing and retrain themselves, it's going to take a long time. And initially, it might. However, in the long run, it will become a habit. It will become easier and it will become something that you know like the back of your hand and it's going to very very much so contribute to a healthier, more fulfilling, and happy balanced life. So that's my update for day 12. Um, I'll check in next to kind of let you know how I'm feeling as I go into week three. Week three is really where, um, you know, I saw most of the results. Uh, you kind of hit a plateau in week two, it seems like, as your body's detoxing. Um, I've lost about four pounds. Um, I was talking to the, one of my coaches today and saying that, you know, in the, all the rounds that I did, I, I lost about eight pounds each. So I'm at the halfway mark and lost about four pounds. So I, I have a feeling that I'm going to reach the same goal. Um, I am a lot heavier now than I was then, um, about 15 pounds heavier. Um, but that is because if you look at pictures of me on round one, I was super, super tiny, no muscle tone, very, very lean. Um, but now I have muscle, my legs are huge, um, I'm carrying a lot of muscle. And so I have to look at myself and my goals and um, the weight and uh, the results a little bit differently. So I may lose the same amount of weight, but not end up at the same um, weight that I ended up on round one, two, and three. And that is totally okay because this program I did to just kind of reset reset my body, reset my eating habits, get my mind back on track, get into habit of eating by plan, and to feel better. And to show everyone who uh, didn't know me in 2012 what this program is and what this program is like and who it's for. So I hope that if you have any questions, you reach out to me and that you realize that you can do this and that it will be life-changing.